What happens when you hold your breath too long? When you hold your breath, your body starts a silent countdown. At first, nothing feels wrong. Oxygen levels stay normal for a few seconds. But as time passes, carbon dioxide begins to build up in your blood, and that's what triggers the urge to breathe. Your brain's medulla oblongata keeps track of those rising CO2 levels. When it senses too much, it sends emergency signals to your diaphragm and chest muscles. That's why your body starts to twitch or tighten as you fight to hold it longer. If you keep pushing, the balance of oxygen and carbon dioxide gets dangerous. Cells begin to run out of fuel, your vision narrows, and black spots can appear. In extreme cases, you could faint as your brain forces you to breathe again. Professional freedivers train their bodies to handle these changes safely. Through practice, they build tolerance to high CO2 and increase oxygen efficiency. But even they know when to stop. The body's need for oxygen always wins. So the next time you try to see how long you can hold your breath, remember that your brain isn't being dramatic. It's protecting you from the most basic threat there is running out of air. This is Quick 60 Fast Facts in 60 Seconds.